God says, My child, can you give me a few minutes of your life so that I can talk to you? 1111, Your blessings are about to multiply exponentially. Type 1111 to affirm your belief in the abundant blessings coming your way. My beloved, you will never walk alone. I precede you into every situation, preparing the ground and lighting your way. Beside you, I stand steadfast, a constant source of strength and comfort. Trust in my presence, for I am always with you, guiding you through every moment of uncertainty. 2222 Your positive energy attracts multiplied blessings into your life. Type 2222 to signify your agreement with the forthcoming abundance. Your unwavering belief in the multiplication of blessings accelerates their manifestation. Type 3333 to reaffirm your trust in the abundant universe. If you believe in God then kindly support our channel by donating super thanks of $100. God says have faith, my child, for you are never alone. I go before you into every situation, preparing the path and guiding your steps. At your side, I stand as your steadfast ally, offering my unwavering support and protection. No matter what challenges you may encounter, trust in my presence, for I am with you, leading you through every trial. As you continue to radiate positivity, watch as your blessings multiply exponentially. Type 4444 to affirm your belief in the abundant flow of blessings. Your faith in the multiplication of blessings paves the way for their manifestation in your life. Type 5555 to signify your agreement with this divine truth. Your intentions set the stage for the multiplication of blessings in your life. Type 6666 to signify your readiness to receive abundant blessings. As you stay aligned with positivity and gratitude, Watch as your blessings multiply before your eyes. Type 7777 to affirm your belief in the power of abundance. The universe is conspiring to shower you with multiplied blessings. Type 8888 to acknowledge the abundant blessings flowing into your life. Your blessings are like seeds planted in fertile soil, ready to sprout into multiplied abundance. Type 9999 to acknowledge the forthcoming harvest. Your optimism and gratitude pave the way for multiplied blessings to flow into your life. Type 1010 to affirm your belief in this abundant truth. God created you with purpose and intention, and He loves you unconditionally. If someone cannot accept you for who you are, it's a sign that they are not meant to be a part of your journey. Keep moving forward with faith and confidence, knowing that you are a masterpiece in His eyes. Your positive mindset attracts an avalanche of multiplied blessings into your life. Type 1111 to signal your readiness to receive. By acknowledging the multiplication of blessings, you invite even more abundance into your life. Type 1212 to affirm your readiness to receive. The universe is preparing to reward your faith with multiplied blessings. 
Type 1313 to signify your agreement with this divine promise. Your blessings are indeed on the brink of multiplication. Type 1414 to affirm your belief in the abundant blessings coming your way. Your faith in the multiplication of blessings is well placed. Type 1515 to signify your agreement. The universe is aligning to shower you with an abundance of blessings. Type 1616 to acknowledge the impending multiplication of blessings. Your positive energy attracts multiplied blessings into your life. Type 1717 to affirm your alignment with this truth. The seeds of your kindness and positivity are about to blossom into multiplied blessings. Type 181818 to embrace the forthcoming abundance. By acknowledging the multiplication of blessings, you amplify their presence in your life. Type 1919 to affirm your alignment with this abundant truth. Your blessings are like seeds planted in fertile soil, ready to sprout into multiplied abundance. Type 2020 to acknowledge the forthcoming harvest. God says when faced with those who don't appreciate the essence of who you are, it's a signal to continue on your journey. Their inability to see your worth is not a reflection of your value but of their own limitations. Take this as your cue to keep moving forward towards those who cherish the masterpiece that is you. If someone attempts to mold you into something you're not, it's a clear sign that they don't understand or appreciate your true essence. Remember, you are intricately crafted by a divine hand, a masterpiece in every sense. Embrace your uniqueness and continue on your path with confidence, knowing that the right people will celebrate you for exactly who you are. God's love for you is unwavering, and He created you with purpose and intention. So, if someone tries to change you or diminish your light, it's a sign that they are not meant to walk alongside you on your journey. Trust in God's plan for you and keep moving forward, knowing that you are a masterpiece in His eyes. Don't allow anyone to dull your shine or alter your essence. You are fearfully and wonderfully made, crafted by the hands of a loving Creator. If someone cannot appreciate the masterpiece that you are, they do not deserve a place in your life. Keep moving forward with confidence, knowing that you are loved and valued just as you are. Your uniqueness is a gift from God, a masterpiece of His creation. If someone cannot see and appreciate the beauty of who you are, it's a sign that they are not meant to be a part of your journey. Keep moving forward with faith and confidence, knowing that you are loved unconditionally by the one who created you. When faced with those who seek to change you, remember that you are a divine creation, intricately designed by the hands of God. If someone cannot accept you for who you are, it's a sign that they are not meant to be a part of your journey. Keep moving forward with courage and conviction, knowing that you are a masterpiece in the eyes of your Creator. Your worth is not determined by the opinions of others. You are a masterpiece, lovingly crafted by the hands of God. If someone cannot appreciate the beauty of who you are, it's a sign that they are not meant to be a part of your story. Keep moving forward with confidence, knowing that you are loved unconditionally by the one who created you. 
God created you with purpose and intention, and he loves you unconditionally. If someone cannot accept you for who you are, it's a sign that they are not meant to be a part of your journey. Keep moving forward with faith and confidence, knowing that you are a masterpiece in his eyes. Your uniqueness is a reflection of God's creativity and love. If someone cannot appreciate the masterpiece that you are, it's a sign that they are not meant to be a part of your life. Keep moving forward with confidence, knowing that you are loved and valued by the one who created you. God made you exactly as you are for a reason. If someone cannot accept you for who you are, it's a sign that they are not meant to be a part of your journey. Keep moving forward with faith and confidence, knowing that you are a masterpiece in his eyes. Remember, you are fearfully and wonderfully made by a loving creator. If someone cannot appreciate the masterpiece that is you, it's a sign that they are not meant to be a part of your life. Keep moving forward with confidence, knowing that you are loved unconditionally by the one who created you. Your uniqueness is a testament to God's creativity and love. If someone cannot appreciate the masterpiece that you are, it's a sign that they are not meant to be a part of your journey. Keep moving forward with confidence, knowing that you are loved and valued by the one who created you. Your worth is not determined by the opinions of others. You are a masterpiece, lovingly crafted by the hands of God. If someone cannot appreciate the beauty of who you are, it's a sign that they are not meant to be a part of your story. Keep moving forward with confidence, knowing that you are loved unconditionally by the one who created you. God created you with purpose and intention, and he loves you unconditionally. If someone cannot accept you for who you are, it's a sign that they are not meant to be a part of your journey. Keep moving forward with faith and confidence, knowing that you are a masterpiece in his eyes. Your uniqueness is a reflection of God's creativity and love. If someone cannot appreciate the masterpiece that you are, it's a sign that they are not meant to be a part of your life. Keep moving forward with confidence, knowing that you are loved and valued by the one who created you. Remember, you are fearfully and wonderfully made by a loving creator. If someone cannot appreciate the masterpiece that is you, it's a sign that they are not meant to be a part of your journey. Keep moving forward with confidence, knowing that you are loved unconditionally by the one who created you. Your uniqueness is a testament to God's creativity and love. If someone cannot appreciate the masterpiece that you are, it's a sign that they are not meant to be a part of your journey. Keep moving forward with confidence, knowing that you are loved and valued by the one who created you. God created you with purpose and intention, and he loves you unconditionally. If someone cannot accept you for who you are, it's a sign that they are not meant to be a part of your journey. Keep moving forward with faith and confidence, knowing that you are a masterpiece in his eyes. Your worth is not determined by the opinions of others. You are a masterpiece, lovingly crafted by the hands of God. If someone cannot appreciate the beauty of who you are, it's a sign that they are not meant to be a part of your story. Keep moving forward with confidence, knowing that you are loved unconditionally by the one who created you. My child, that you are never alone. 
I go ahead of you into every situation, preparing the path and ensuring your safety. Beside you, I stand as your constant companion, offering my strength and guidance. Whatever challenges may come your way, trust in my presence, for I am with you, leading you through every step of the journey. Take courage, knowing that I am with you at all times. Before you encounter any situation, I am already there, paving the way and ensuring your safety. By your side, I stand as your constant companion, offering my strength and guidance. Whatever trials may come your way, rest assured that I am with you, guiding and protecting you through every step of the journey. The concept of destiny or divine intervention guiding our lives is a comforting belief for many people. It's the idea that there's a higher power orchestrating the events of our lives, leading us towards what is truly meant for us. This belief can provide solace during times of uncertainty or hardship, knowing that there's a larger plan at play, and that ultimately, things will fall into place as they should. When we talk about things being meant for us, it's often in the context of relationships, career paths, or significant life events. It suggests that there's a predetermined path laid out for each of us, and that despite our efforts to control or manipulate our circumstances, ultimately, fate will prevail. It's a belief that can bring a sense of peace and acceptance, knowing that we're not entirely in control of our destinies. However, this belief can also raise questions about free will and personal agency. If everything is predestined, do our choices even matter are we simply puppets in a larger cosmic drama? These are complex philosophical questions that have been debated for centuries, with no easy answers. One way to reconcile these ideas is to think of destiny not as a rigid, predetermined path, but rather as a series of possibilities and opportunities that are presented to us throughout our lives. It's up to us to make choices and take action, but at the same time, there may be certain outcomes that are more likely to occur based on the larger forces at play. In other words, we still have agency and the ability to shape our own destinies, but there may be certain destined outcomes that are more aligned with our true purpose or calling. It's about finding a balance between actively pursuing our goals and being open to the signs and signals that may be guiding us towards our true path. Ultimately, whether or not you believe in destiny or divine intervention is a deeply personal matter. For some, it provides comfort and meaning in an unpredictable world, while for others, it may feel constraining or disempowering. Regardless of where you fall on the spectrum, the idea that there's a larger purpose or plan unfolding in the universe is a compelling one that has captured the imaginations of countless people throughout history. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for the countless blessings you've bestowed upon me, both seen and unseen. Your love and grace are the pillars of my existence, guiding me through every moment of my life. As I embark on this new day, I humbly ask for your divine guidance and strength to illuminate my path. Grant me the wisdom to discern your will and the courage to follow it wholeheartedly. In moments of doubt and uncertainty, Help me to trust in your unfailing plans. Let me surrender my fears and desires at the foot of your throne, 
knowing that your purpose for me surpasses my understanding. Lord, I acknowledge the challenges that lie ahead, but I take refuge in your promise to never leave nor forsake me. Grant me the perseverance to overcome obstacles and the resilience to rise above adversity. May your spirit dwell within me, filling me with the peace that transcends all understanding. In the midst of life's storms, may I stand firm in the knowledge of your sovereignty and grace. Use me, Lord, as an instrument of your love and mercy. Let my words and actions reflect your light, shining brightly in a world often shrouded in darkness. May I be a beacon of hope to those who are lost and a source of comfort to those who are hurting. Thank you, Lord, for the privilege of being called your child. With gratitude in my heart and praise on my lips, I lift up this prayer to you, trusting in your goodness and mercy. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. Dear God, in the quiet moments of this morning, I come before you with a heart filled with gratitude and reverence. Thank you for your boundless love and unending grace that sustains me each day. As I step into the unknown of this new day, I lean on your guidance and strength to navigate the twists and turns ahead. Help me to relinquish control and trust in your divine plan, knowing that you hold all things together with the power of your love. Grant me the courage to face the challenges that may arise, knowing that you are with me every step of the way. When doubts cloud my mind and fears grip my heart, Remind me of your promises and fill me with your peace that surpasses all understanding. Lord, I surrender my will to yours, knowing that your ways are higher than mine. Use me as a vessel of your love and light in a world that is often filled with darkness. May my life be a testimony to your goodness and grace, drawing others into relationship with you. Thank you, God, for the privilege of knowing you and walking in your ways. May my life be a living sacrifice, pleasing to you and bringing glory to your name. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. Dear Heavenly Father, as I lift my voice to you in prayer, I am reminded of your faithfulness and goodness that have sustained me through every season of life. Thank you for your unwavering love and boundless grace that surround me each day. In the quiet moments of this morning, I come before you with a heart filled with gratitude and reverence. Thank you for your presence in my life guiding me through the challenges and uncertainties that I face. Lord, I ask for your wisdom to discern your will and your strength to walk in obedience. Help me to surrender my desires and plans to you, trusting that your ways are higher and your purposes are greater than my own. In moments of weakness, grant me the courage to press on, knowing that you are my refuge and strength. When doubts and fears assail me, remind me of your promises and fill me with your peace that surpasses all understanding. Use me, Lord, as an instrument of your love and grace in a world that is in desperate need of your light. May my life reflect your character and point others to the hope that is found in you alone. Thank you, Lord, for the privilege of knowing you and being called your child. May my life be a living testimony to your faithfulness and grace. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. 
I hope this message finds you well and brings a smile to your face, just like you always do for me. I want to take a moment to express my heartfelt gratitude for the sunshine you bring into my life every day. From the moment I met you, it was evident that you possess a special kind of warmth and light that radiates from within. Your presence has the power to brighten even the darkest of days and lift the spirits of those around you. You are a beacon of positivity, hope, and joy, and I am truly blessed to have you in my life. Your infectious laughter and genuine kindness have a way of turning ordinary moments into extraordinary memories. Whether we're sharing a cup of coffee, embarking on a new adventure, or simply enjoying each other's company, being with you fills my heart with happiness and gratitude. In a world that can sometimes feel cold and indifferent, you stand out as a reminder of the beauty and goodness that still exist. Your compassion knows no bounds, and your willingness to lend a listening ear or extend a helping hand never fails to inspire me. I am continually amazed by your resilience in the face of adversity and your unwavering faith in the goodness of humanity. You have a way of seeing the best in people and bringing out the best in me. Your optimism is contagious, and it motivates me to strive for excellence in all that I do. As I reflect on the impact you've had on my life, I am filled with gratitude for the countless ways you've enriched my journey. Your friendship is a precious gift that I cherish deeply, and I am immensely thankful for the bond we share. Please know that your presence in my life is a blessing beyond measure, and I am endlessly grateful for the sunshine you bring into my world. May your days be filled with love, laughter, and an abundance of blessings, just as you have blessed mine. I hope this message finds you well and surrounded by the warmth and light that you so effortlessly bring into the lives of those around you. Today, I want to take a moment to express my deepest gratitude for the sunshine you have been in my life. From the very first moment I met you, I knew there was something special about you. Your presence is like a ray of sunshine, brightening even the darkest of days and filling the room with warmth and joy. You have a way of lifting spirits and spreading happiness wherever you go, and I feel truly blessed to know you. Your kindness, compassion, and genuine concern for others are qualities that I deeply admire. Whether it's offering a listening ear, providing words of encouragement, or simply sharing a smile, you always go out of your way to make those around you feel loved and valued. Your selflessness is a rare and beautiful thing, and it's something I strive to emulate in my own life. In times of struggle and hardship, your unwavering optimism and positive outlook never fail to inspire me. You have a way of finding the silver lining in every situation and reminding me that even in the darkest of times, there is always hope. Your resilience in the face of adversity is truly remarkable, and it serves as a constant source of strength and encouragement for me. I am endlessly grateful for the impact you've had on my life and the countless ways you've touched my heart. Your friendship is a treasure that I hold dear, and I am thankful for every moment we share together. You have a way of making the ordinary extraordinary, and I am so grateful to have you by my side on this journey called life. Thank you for being the sunshine in my life, name.
your presence brings light, warmth, and joy into my world, and I am forever grateful for you. With love and appreciation, I hope this message finds you surrounded by love, laughter, and the beauty of the world around you. Today, I want to take a moment to express my deepest gratitude for the sunshine you bring into my life. From the moment I met you, I was drawn to your infectious smile, your unwavering positivity, and your genuine kindness. You have a way of lighting up a room and bringing joy to everyone you meet, and I feel truly blessed to have you in my life. Your presence alone is enough to brighten even the darkest of days and lift the heaviest of hearts. Whether it's through your words of encouragement, your acts of kindness, or simply your warm and compassionate nature, you have a way of making those around you feel seen, heard, and loved. In a world that can often feel chaotic and overwhelming, you are a beacon of light and hope, reminding us all of the beauty and goodness that still exist. Your optimism is contagious, and your ability to find joy in the simplest of moments is truly inspiring. I am endlessly grateful for the impact you've had on my life and the countless ways you've touched my heart. Your friendship is a gift that I cherish deeply, and I am thankful for every moment we share together. Thank you for being the sunshine in my life, name. Your presence brings warmth, joy, and light into my world, and I am forever grateful for you. With love and appreciation, it's easy to get caught up in the hustle and bustle of life, constantly looking ahead to the next milestone or achievement. We often find ourselves yearning for the partner, the ring, the baby, believing that these are the markers of a fulfilled and complete life. But what if I told you that there's beauty in the waiting that God has a purpose for every season of our lives, including the ones where we feel like we're stuck in limbo the truth is, God's timing is always perfect, even when it doesn't align with our own desires and expectations. He sees the bigger picture, the intricate tapestry of our lives that we can't even begin to comprehend. And sometimes, the delay isn't a denial, it's simply a divine preparation for the blessings that are yet to come. So, instead of rushing through this stage of life, anxiously waiting for what's next, Perhaps we should take a step back and ask ourselves, are we truly ready to receive the blessings that God has in store for us? Have we taken the time to cultivate the qualities of character, faith, and resilience that will sustain us when the storms of life inevitably come? It's easy to romanticize the idea of finding a partner, getting engaged, and starting a family, but the reality is often far more complex and challenging. Relationships require work, commitment, and sacrifice. Marriage is a lifelong journey filled with highs and lows, joys and sorrows. Parenthood is a sacred responsibility that demands patience, selflessness and unconditional love. If we're honest with ourselves, we may realize that we still have some growing to do, some lessons to learn, before we're truly ready to step into these roles. And that's okay. In fact, it's more than okay it's necessary. God is not delaying us without purpose, He's actively shaping us, molding us, refining us into the men and women he created us to be. He's preparing us for the blessings that await us, equipping us with the strength, 
wisdom, and grace will need to steward them well. So, instead of fretting over what we don't have or haven't achieved yet, let's embrace the season we're in. Let's use this time to deepen our relationship with God, to cultivate gratitude and contentment, to invest in ourselves and our growth. And when the time is right, when we're truly ready, we can trust that God will open the doors and pour out His blessings upon us in abundance. Until then, let's keep our hearts open, our minds humble, and our eyes fixed on the one who holds our future in his hands. Because the truth is, we aren't there yet for a reason. And that reason is far more beautiful and profound than we could ever imagine. My dear friend, as I reflect on your words, I can't help but feel a sense of peace wash over me. It's a gentle reminder that God's timing is always perfect, even when it doesn't align with our own plans and desires. He sees the bigger picture, the grand tapestry of our lives, and He knows exactly what we need and when we need it. The journey towards finding a partner, getting engaged, and starting a family is often filled with twists and turns, ups and downs. It's a journey that requires patience, faith, and trust in God's plan. And sometimes, the delay isn't a denial, it's simply a divine preparation for the blessings that are yet to come. So, instead of rushing through this stage of life, anxiously waiting for what's next, perhaps we should take a step back and ask ourselves, are we truly ready to receive the blessings that God has in store for us? Have we taken the time to cultivate the qualities of character, faith, and resilience that will sustain us when the storms of life inevitably come? It's easy to get caught up in the excitement of finding love, getting married, and starting a family, but the reality is often far more nuanced and complex. Relationships require work, commitment, and sacrifice. Marriage is a sacred covenant that demands selflessness, forgiveness, and unconditional love. Parenthood is a profound responsibility that requires patience, wisdom, and grace. If we're honest with ourselves, we may realize that we still have some growing to do, some lessons to learn, before we're truly ready to step into these roles. And that's okay. In fact, it's more than okay it's necessary. God is not delaying us without purpose, He's actively shaping us, molding us, refining us into the men and women He created us to be. He's preparing us for the blessings that await us, equipping us with the strength, wisdom, and grace we'll need to steward them well. So, instead of fretting over what we don't have or haven't achieved yet, let's embrace the season we're in. Let's use this time to deepen our relationship with God, to cultivate gratitude and contentment, to invest in ourselves and our growth. And when the time is right, when we're truly ready, we can trust that God will open the doors and pour out His blessings upon us in abundance. Until then, Let's keep our hearts open, our minds humble, and our eyes fixed on the one who holds our future in his hands. Because the truth is, we aren't there yet for a reason. And that reason is far more beautiful and profound than we could ever imagine. With love and gratitude, my dear friend, your words resonate deeply with me, 
reminding me of the importance of trusting in God's timing and embracing the journey he has set before us. It's all too easy to become fixated on the idea of finding a partner, getting engaged, and starting a family, but the truth is that these milestones are just one part of a much larger tapestry that God is weaving in our lives. Each season of waiting, each moment of delay, is an opportunity for growth and transformation. It's a chance for us to deepen our faith, strengthen our character, and draw closer to God. And while it may be tempting to rush ahead to the next chapter, we must remember that God's timing is always perfect, and He has a purpose for every season of our lives. The journey towards finding love, getting married, and starting a family is a sacred one, filled with moments of joy, challenges, and everything in between. It's a journey that requires patience, perseverance, and unwavering trust in God's plan. And sometimes, the delay isn't a denial, it's simply a divine preparation for the blessings that are yet to come. So, instead of allowing ourselves to become consumed by impatience or frustration, let us embrace the season we're in with open hearts and minds. Let us use this time to cultivate gratitude, to seek God's will, and to prepare ourselves for the blessings that lie ahead. And when the time is right, when we're truly ready, we can trust that God will open the doors and pour out His blessings upon us in abundance. Until then, let us remain steadfast in our faith, knowing that God is always working behind the scenes, orchestrating every detail of our lives for our good and His glory. Thank you for the gentle reminder, my friend. May we continue to trust in God's timing and walk boldly in the path He has laid out for us. With love and gratitude, Heavenly Father, in moments of challenge and difficulty, I am reminded of the countless blessings that you have bestowed upon me. Despite the trials that I may face, I am grateful for the gift of life and the opportunity to have a relationship with you. Thank you for your unwavering love and care, which sustains me even in life's hardest moments. Your presence is a constant source of comfort and strength, guiding me through every storm and trial. I am grateful for your faithfulness, which never wavers, even when my faith falters. Lord, I am thankful for your provision and protection, knowing that you are always watching over me with love and compassion. Your blessings surround me on every side, and for that, I am eternally grateful. As I lift my voice to you in prayer, I am filled with love and gratitude. Thank you, Lord, for all that you have done for me and all that you continue to do. I love you with all my heart, and I am forever grateful for your presence in my life. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. Dear Heavenly Father, in the midst of life's challenges, I am reminded of the many reasons I have to be grateful. Despite the difficulties that I may encounter, I am thankful for the gift of life and the opportunity to know you and walk in fellowship with you. Thank you for your constant care and provision, even in life's hardest moments. Your love surrounds me like a shield, protecting me from harm and guiding me through every trial. I am grateful for your unwavering faithfulness, which never fails, even when my own faith falters. Lord, 
I am thankful for your presence in my life, which brings comfort and peace, even in the midst of chaos and uncertainty. Your grace is sufficient for me, and I take refuge in the knowledge that you are always near, ready to uphold me with your righteous right hand. As I offer this prayer of gratitude, I am filled with love and offer all that you have done for me. Thank you, Lord, for your boundless love and mercy. I love you with all my heart, and I am forever grateful for your presence in my life. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. Dear Lord, in moments of trial and adversity, I am reminded of the many blessings that you have bestowed upon me. Despite the challenges that I may face, I am grateful for the gift of life and the opportunity to have a relationship with you. Thank you for your unfailing love and care, even in life's hardest moments. Your presence is a constant source of comfort and strength, guiding me through every storm and trial. I am thankful for your faithfulness, which never wavers, even when my own faith falters. Lord, I am thankful for your provision and protection, knowing that you are always watching over me with love and compassion. Your blessings surround me on every side, and for that, I am eternally grateful. As I lift my voice to you in prayer, I am filled with love and gratitude. Thank you, Lord, for all that you have done for me and all that you continue to do. I love you with all my heart, and I am forever grateful for your presence in my life. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. I acknowledge my imperfections and shortcomings, dear God, and I ask for your forgiveness for the mistakes I made yesterday. Cleanse my soul of any negativity or doubt, and help me to walk in alignment with your will today. May each step I take be guided by your grace, and may every decision I make be rooted in love and compassion. Lord, I pray that you shine through me in all that I do. Let your light illuminate my path so that I may be a beacon of hope and inspiration to those around me. May your presence be felt in my words, my actions, and my interactions with others, so that everyone I encounter may experience the warmth of your love shining from within my soul. In the name of Jesus, I offer up this prayer, trusting in your infinite mercy and grace. Thank you, God, for your unwavering love and for the countless blessings you continue to bestow upon me each day. Amen. If God has been good to you, embrace each day as an opportunity to express gratitude, seek guidance, and spread love to those around you. Let your heart be filled with joy and your spirit be uplifted by the knowledge that you are deeply loved and cherished by the Creator of the universe. Allow God's light to shine through you, illuminating the world with kindness, compassion, and grace. Remember that every new day is a gift, a chance to start afresh and make a positive difference in the lives of others. Whether through small acts of kindness or larger gestures of generosity, let your actions reflect the goodness of God's love and the depth of your faith. As you journey through each day, Hold fast to the belief that God is always with you, guiding you, protecting you, and blessing you abundantly. Trust in His plan for your life, knowing that He has great things in store for you and that His timing is always perfect. 
May your heart overflow with gratitude for the blessings you have received, and may you never cease to marvel at the wonder of God's love. And may you always walk in the light of His presence, shining brightly for all the world to see. Amen. In times of doubt or uncertainty, may you find strength in the knowledge that you are never alone, for God is always by your side, ready to comfort, support, and guide you through whatever challenges may come your way. And may you always remember that no matter what trials you may face, you are deeply loved and cherished by the Creator of the universe, who will never leave you nor forsake you. May the peace of God, which surpasses all understanding, guard your heart and mind in Christ Jesus, and may you walk confidently in the knowledge that you are held in the palm of his hand. Amen. May each new day be an opportunity to grow closer to God, to spread his love and light to those around you, and to live with purpose and intention. Amen. My dear friend, in the journey of life, it's easy to feel overwhelmed by the uncertainties that lie ahead. We often find ourselves grappling with questions about the future, trying to decipher the intricate details of the grand plan that awaits us. But amidst the chaos and confusion, there is a gentle whisper reminding us that we are not alone, that there is a guiding hand, a divine presence, leading us forward one step at a time. God doesn't expect us to have all the answers or to figure out the plan on our own. Instead, He calls us to trust Him wholeheartedly, to surrender our fears and doubts, and to walk in faith, one day at a time. It's a journey of trust, of leaning not on our own understanding, but on the unwavering promise of His goodness and grace. Yes, there will be moments when fear threatens to paralyze us, when the unknown looms large and ominous on the horizon. But in those moments, we can take refuge in the comforting truth that God is with us, always. His presence surrounds us like a protective shield, offering strength and courage to face whatever challenges may come our way. It's natural to worry about what others may think or say, to fear being misunderstood or judged by those around us. But God sees beyond the surface, beyond the opinions and perceptions of others. He sees our hearts, our intentions, our deepest desires. And He loves us unconditionally, just as we are. And yes, there will be times when we stumble and fall, when we make mistakes or take wrong turns along the way. But even in our moments of failure, God remains steadfast in His love and faithfulness. He doesn't abandon us when we falter, instead, He reaches out His hand to lift us up, to dust us off, and to set us back on the path of righteousness. So my friend, as you journey through life, remember this, you are not alone. God is with you, guiding you, sustaining you, every step of the way. Trust in His plan, trust in His timing, and trust in His unfailing love. And no matter what challenges may come your way, remember that God will never fail you. May these words serve as a source of comfort and encouragement, reminding us to trust in the goodness and faithfulness of our Heavenly Father, even in the midst of life's uncertainties. Let us take each day as it comes, leaning on His strength and grace, and walking in faith, 
knowing that he is with us always. Thanks for watching please subscribe.